We here at Dartmouth tend to attract a, a unique kind of student, one that really values this approach to human-centered engineering and innovation, that values the liberal arts as being an integral and incredibly important piece of their engineering educational experience. Our students tend to leave with a much more holistic understanding of engineering and therefore can tackle very complex systems-oriented type problems. The new building is an opportunity to really integrate engineering with computer science in a much more meaningful way by helping to have an even greater impact on society through the research and discovery that our faculty and staff and students are doing. So with the new building, we will more than double the space available to engineering here on the Dartmouth campus. And what that brings us is the resources and the space to increase our faculty size, which will then allow us to focus even more on research and discovery and innovation. It will provide us an opportunity to draw more students over to this side of campus to take an engineering or computer science class, no matter what your major is. The intermingling of our faculty and staff and students in the building and on this side of campus will only enrich the, those opportunities. We live and breathe problem-based engineering in a way that you see sprinklings of at other campuses, but we do so well and is so part of our DNA here. And so by being able to have those experiences in the new building will really transform the opportunities that our students can engage in. Through this new building, through growth and expansion, we are providing that opportunity. We're demonstrating to the world that here at Dartmouth we see the challenges and opportunity of technology and see it as a priority for our institution and a real opportunity to have the kind of impact on society that is needed.